Let's talk about President Mamad Buhari don't approve say make the state carry the closing of the Niger border with neighboring countries to January 31st next year. The code when we say they call Operation Exercise Swift Response, it don't cause collaborative border operation by one combined team of security joint body. The deputy controller of the customs when we say they're in charge of enforcement, investigate and inspectorate, Victor Dimka. He do the presidential directive for one memo to the sector coordinator them. The memo talks even with the Ogbonga success of the operation, especially for the security and economic benefit to the nation. They say they go achieve small strategy them. And they say the need to achieve uh, the strategic objective of the exercise inform the extension of this space by the president. He confirmed as go take pay operative when they involved for the joint operation, the public relations officer, Niger Customs Service, Joseph Atta, I confirm the matter. They say the Niger Customs Service say they're not going to open the border when they close until they get what they want. The Custom Public Relations Officer Joseph Atta talked this one as they shook mad for the service memo when they leak for the media. For Abuja on Sunday, he said the internal memo, they talk of the end of one phase of the joint security operation when they call a swift response. As he said, he said the memo will not be the date for the border when they close for now. He said security operation for this kind, they step by step. The NCS Controller General, Colonel Ahmed Ali, retired. He don't say the main, the main thing when he said that they take the closed border, not to see say the neighboring countries do as the ECOWAS protocols want for transit. He said the protocol for transit take customs for neighboring countries to escort things when he said that they enter Niger to the borders so that the importers no go stop payment of duties. He said the Palava don't help uh, to stop harms and things when he said that they injure people to enter the country.